What is up everybody, Garden State Aviation here, back with another video. This is the final airport update of the year. This is the December 2021 Newark Liberty International Airport update. Without further ado, let's get started. Starting off this airport update, we have this United 777-300ER. This is in their Blue Evolution slash new livery. He's letting up passengers for a flight out to Milan Mall Penza International Airport after coming in from San Francisco. Here next to the United 777-300ER in the Blue Evolution slash new livery, we have another United Blue Evo. This one is a 787-9. Earlier today, he came in from Sao Paulo and tomorrow morning, he'll be letting up passengers for a flight out to Tokyo Narita. Here at gate S4 or Sierra 4, we have this United 787-10 Dream Liner. This is in their Blue Evolution slash new livery. Earlier today, he came in from London Heathrow, and tomorrow morning, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight out to Amsterdam Schiphol. Moving on to the international stands on the other side of the airport, here we have this SAS A350-900. This is in their new livery. Early today, he came in from Oslo Gardermoen International Airport, and later today, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight out to Stockholm, Arlanda. Next to the SAS A350, here we have this lot uh, 7878 Dream Liner. This is in their normal livery. Earlier today, he came in from Warsaw, and later today, he'll be loading up passengers on a special flight out to Krakow. Between the international and domestic slash neutral stands, here we have a rare visitor. We have this Glider Air 747-400, this is in their Not Without My Mask livery. He's coming out of maintenance and heading to the cargo stands, and then he'll be then loading up for a flight out to Louisville, Kentucky. Here we have this United Express Embraer ERJ-175, this is in their Continental slash Old livery. Earlier today, he came in from Raleigh, Durham, and later today, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight out to Hilton Head. Next to the United E-175, here we have this Alaska Auto Goes Who Serve 737-800. Earlier today, he came in from San Diego, and later today, he'll be loading up passengers for a special charter flight out to Houston Hobby. Moving on down the line, here we have this Delta 737-800. This is in their normal livery. Earlier today, he came in from Atlanta, and later today, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight back out on his return to Atlanta. Here at gate S25 or CR25, we have this American 737-800. This is in their Astrojet Chrome livery. Earlier today, he came in from Charlotte, and later today, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight out to Miami. Here at gate S24 or CR24, we have this Delta Connection CRJ900. Earlier today, he came in from Minneapolis, and later today, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight out to Cincinnati. Here we have this United 757-200. This is in their Herard here in New York, New Jersey livery. He's taxing the maintenance after coming from stands on the opposite side of the airport after coming in from a flight from Reykjavik Keflavik International. Here on the opposite side of the mainline slash regional stands, here we have this United 77-700. This is in their Golden Globe slash Continental livery. Earlier today, he came in from Providenciales and later today, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight out to San Juan. Next to the UA 77-700, we have its older brother. We have the United 727-800. This is in their Blue Evolution slash new livery. Earlier today, he came in from Denver and mid today, hopefully they got passengers for a flight out to Cheyenne, Wyoming. Here we have this Spirit AT-21. This is in their Bananas livery. Earlier today, he came in on a flight from Fort Lauderdale. And later today, hopefully they got passengers for a flight out to Tampa. Moving on to the last aircraft here in the mainland slash regional stands, here we have this United 77-700, this is in their Blue Evolution slash new livery. Earlier today, he came in on a flight from Kingston, and later today, he'll be loading up passengers for a flight up to Boston. And moving on to the last aircraft of this airport update, here we have the CargoJet 767-300F, this is in their normal livery. Yesterday, he came in from a flight from Hamilton John C. Monroe International Airport, and later today, he'll be loading up a lot of cargo for a flight out to Bermuda. That being said, that does conclude the final airport.